Hi Libra, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your reading for May. This is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. This is for at any time in May, okay? And this is for Libra. What do we got for Libra? What, what What's coming in for Libra? Ooh, you gotta make a decision. You know, this is needing to make a decision, a choice. And you gotta be open-minded about it. You may be blocking the truth. You may be, maybe you're, you're burying something that needs to be unburied. You have to make a difficult decision, period. Ooh, you may be dealing with a Taurus Virgo Capricorn here. Um, this is somebody that is very stable, valuable. This person knows their value. This could be you, Libra. You could be taking on this energy, you know, of knowing what you're worth. This is a very hard worker right here. This is a hard worker. We have a planner. But this is denial. So, hmm. I'm going to keep going before I start talking. Um, ooh. Now, this is a fresh start. Could be a reconciliation. I'm not sure. You could be denying the truth, though. I'm just being honest with you. Because you got to always see what's mirroring each other. I, I can't just give you all roses if it's not. This is denial. Some of you may be needing to wake up. This is a wake-up call. You're going on you're going your own way, starting a new journey. The the fool starts the journey by themselves. This could this could be a very prominent man in your life that has denied you and now you have to go your own way. Now that judgment, that is a card of karma. So we do have some sort of karmic situation here. This is starting fresh. So that is starting from scratch, starting a new journey with faith. Uh-oh. <laughs> Yikes. So I don't know if you've been cheated or if you've been lied to and you've been in denial. Ooh, there's some conflict. You may receive a message that you don't want to hear about this person. This person may be... You know, this person, this king of, this king of uh, pentacles is... Stable and secure. They're good where they're at. So you may receive some sort of message that you don't want to hear that they have made a decision. A decision has been made. This is a decision has been made. You be, may be making a decision. Libra, you may make, be making a decision to cut somebody out of your life because you deserve love. Um, if you are the Libra female watching this, you probably have two options. And you have to make a difficult choice. Do you want to cheat yourself of love by hanging on to the hope that there's going to be a reconciliation with somebody? I mean, that could certainly be the case. Or do you want to come out of this darkness? Do you want to come out of hiding and start a new journey in, with somebody else? So, I, you know, I feel like you are probably, re you have to make a decision and it's a difficult decision. I think that you're probably going to receive a message from somebody. Um, This message may make you feel insecure or it may test your insecurities. 
I think you were dealing with a person that may that maybe they cheated you or they lied to you. They may have ghosted you. And now they want to talk. Now they want you forgiveness. So be careful. I mean, this is forgiveness. So somebody may want forgiveness. And now you have to make a choice. You do have to make a choice. Now, do you choose yourself? Or do you choose the other person? I mean, you may have somebody coming in to offer you something of value, but you don't trust them. They lied to you. They blocked you. You know, that kind of thing. Um, this is have faith. Listen to your inner guide. Follow your heart. Follow your intuition. I, I really feel like... That five of pentacles reverse, that's the end of difficulty. Not putting in effort, not working hard, no moving forward, no victory in success. Things could be really emotional. You're going to receive a message that may make you emotional. Somebody has given up, and I have to be honest with you, and now you have to go your own way. You have to. It's like now you have to. Maybe the decision has been made for you. Karma, the truth. Um, no more growth there. It's unrealistic. Oh my goodness. So I feel like you may receive a message, obviously, that's what this is, that you don't want to hear, that's, gonna, that's going to probably push you in a new direction. And you're going to need to have faith. You're going to need to believe in yourself. You need to, go to need to follow your own path. I see you starting on a new journey, um, accepting the truth. This is acceptance. It really is. I think somebody here has been hoping for a reconciliation and the truth is is that this a person that they've been hoping for a reconciliation with is stable, they're secure, they're they're good where they're at and they're, you know, yeah, there it's not practical or realistic that this person would uh change. Okay? This person is stubborn, this person's mind is made up. I think this person has is not focused on whoever this person is that you have been in denial about. It's not realistic. It's not practical. It's not. It's a lie. I'm sorry. It's it's deception. You may be deceiving yourself because of your love, the, the love that you had. Anyway, it's not meant to be. Okay. So anyway, I feel like you have a new journey starting. You may have probably conflicted about it. You probably have an opportunity to, well, you do have to make a decision. And it is between two people, whether it's lovers or a parent and a lover or, you know, there's definitely two people here and you're going to have to make a choice. Like you're going to have to choose which way you're going to go. You're going to have to release something. Something is being released It's like giving up the fight. You don't have, it's like you don't have a choice. This person may be relocating. They may be moving. And therefore, you're, there's no closure. There's, there's, this is, there's, there's like, there's unfinished business. There is unfinished business. There's unfinished business because you're not going to get the closure that you seek. I'm sorry. Yeah, I think that there's a loss. I'm sorry. I am. I really, really am. There's an emotional loss here. <clears throat> a loss of a, a loss of a love, okay? And I feel like you have to come to terms with it. And I think that, that there's going to be a message that comes through that wakes you up 
and pushes you down a new journey, pushes you on a new journey, pushes you to start over. It, it allows you to start with a clean slate, to start fresh. It's like cords are being cut. You've probably been reluctant, but it's time. It's time to, for relief. It's time to stop playing this game and go after happiness. So I feel like happiness is imminent, but it's not with the one that cheated you. It's not the one that blocked you. It's not with the one that you are in denial about, okay? Because... This is a completion of that relationship. Tens are a completion that will lead you to something better or lead you to extreme happiness once you accept it. Um, yeah, it's over. It is. It's, this is the end. It's the end of a relationship that you have held on to. And I'm sorry, but that is exactly what this is. And there's an opportunity for a new one once you totally liberate yourself from the situation. But I see a period of isolation. I see, a, I see taking a break, going within to um, release and let go. So I think you're going to receive a message that you don't want to hear, that it's going to push you in a new direction on your own, going your own way, taking a leap of faith. Definitely we have faith here. You know, taking a leap of faith in a new direction, facing your fears. Um, you may be deciding to relocate because there's no no growth here. There's there's things have been stale, things have been stagnant, stagnant. There's been no forward movement. There's been no progress being made, and this is a realization that you know it is time to live again. It's it's time to rise up from my ashes. It's time to start over. So I think you guys are going to get some sort of epiphany or message from somebody that says, you know what, I, I have no choice but to start, but to start over, start fresh, to fly. So I think that you are going to be flying solo, going a new, going a new path. I do believe that you will probably have somebody that will help you. You have somebody that will be there to support you emotionally. And in the end, when this is all over, you will find happiness. But I do see a period of healing that is needed. So there's a delay in finding your happily ever after because healing is needed. You have to nurture yourself for a little while. I think that, you know, your health, somebody needs to work on their health. They need to work on their attractiveness. They need to build their confidence and their self-esteem back up. And that could take, you know, another, you know, he could say four months. Four months of working on you before you can, you know, go out and play again so yeah I feel like right now it's not about finding a partnership it's about healing I think that there's probably the end of a contract here that is somebody is realizing that this contract is up it's over there is somebody that's better suited for you but it's not the one that you think it is I gotta be honest, that's what this is. It's somebody else. That could make you very happy, but if you keep holding on to the one that blocked you and cheated you and lied to you, well, then there's consequences. So this is a card of consequences. You don't find your happiness holding on to somebody that doesn't reciprocate. So anyway, there's an opportunity for happiness after you let go of the contract that is keeping you stuck. You can't lie to yourself. Don't lie to yourself. It's time to 
It's over. Stand up. Swallow your pride. And step on to your new journey with faith. This angel, this angel right here, this angel, this karma, this judgment will bring you what you are meant to have at exactly the right time. All you have to do is have faith. So Libra, what I have for you is you receiving a message, unfortunately, with that page of swords that you don't want to hear. That's a that's a conflicting, a conflicting message. It really is. Difficult message. That message that comes through is go it's right next, it's going to push you in a new direction. And you can't take the past with you. The fool does not take it. No. Mm -mm. That stays. You are starting in a new direction. Leaving it all behind. That's what I see. This is a very, very, very new beginning. I mean, it's the newest beginning of them all. You have a new beginning here. But it starts with you and you alone. And that's what I got. I see you starting in a new direction by yourself. That's what I got. <laughs>